Am I the a-hole for removing my wife's child out of my will after I discovered he's not mine? I've been married for 15 years with my wife and our son is 18 years old. I think I was a good father to him, always present, always supporting him. I was the first he talked to when he had a bullying problem, a math problem, when he needed romantic advice. He is straight but likes cross-dressing and doing makeup, and I was the first one to support him on that too, while his mom was trying to make him more masculine. However, recently I discovered that he is not actually my child. My mother-in-law said that she had to tell me something important, so I went to meet her and told me that my child is actually my wife's high school boyfriend's baby. She gave birth at 20 but apparently she was cheating on me with her old boyfriend. My mother-in-law said that my wife told her the truth after he was born because she had suspected that the baby didn't exactly look like me and my mother-in-law confronted her about it, but the baby was already born and nothing could be done. I was mad and asked her why is she telling me this right now. She told me that it's because she saw my son hanging out with his bio dad at a park and believes that he is back in their lives. I decided not to shoot the messenger and went out to confront my wife and son about this. After a long argument they told the truth. The bio dad was back and wanted to meet his real son. A lot of things happened. I am divorcing and also cutting my wife's son out of my will because I never had a real son and all this time I was putting all my energy and effort into raising another man's child. I'm also consulting if it is possible to sue the bio dad for all the money I've spent raising his bio son throughout the years. My wife is obviously mad at me, but my stepson is just devastated. I can see him depressed, not talking to me, and constantly apologizing. My plan was to divorce and cut contact with them right after that. But now I'm wondering if I'm going too far by punishing him too. Am I the a-hole for doing this? Edit. Everybody's asking about this. The kid knew about his bio dad for about four months before I discovered it. And yes, we did a DNA test. He insisted on a lot of it and after it came back negative, I think is when his depression really hit. Y'all right, maybe it is useless to sue the bio dad, but I'll ask a lawyer anyway. Here are the top comments, plus Opie's reply. Pretty convenient for bio dad to come into the picture when his financial duties would be over. OP replied. Yes, I'm sure it was no accident. You and the child are both innocent and both victims. An 18-year-long deception takes time for you both to process and contemplate. Divorcing your wife for deceiving you for so long does not take much time to assess. But you and your son are still exactly that, dad and son until you decide otherwise. Neither of you should rush to a decision about undoing that. Don't hold it against your son that he has engaged with bio dad as clearly this is another manipulation by the mother. Not the a-hole to divorce her, she sucks, but treating your son like he hasn't been your son for the last 18 years. What the f***? He didn't choose you any more than you chose him. He clearly loves you and sees you as his father. Imagine yourself in his shoes.